how to join a Zoom meeting with using a computer or a cell phone. In this video, I'm going to show you how to join a Zoom meeting with a computer or a cell phone. So, I've just received a Zoom invite. What do I do? Okay, let's get started right now. Okay, I'm on my cell phone and I want to join a Zoom meeting. I'm going to walk you through this step by step. Okay, so I just received an email, or we just received an email about a Zoom invite. I want to access the meeting on my phone. So I need to download the Zoom app. So go to the App Store. So I go to the App Store, and I'm assuming everyone has an iPhone, so that's really not a good assumption. I'm going to go here. Click on the search button. And I'm going to type in in the search bar Zoom. Search. And Zoom Cloud Meeting. I have already downloaded it on my other phone, so it's already here. So let's install this. Okay, so I go into my mail. I received a Zoom invitation here. Okay, all I need to do is click on because I already have the zoom app loaded click on the link click on this guy here zoom will open up now it's gonna ask me a couple of questions this is my wife's phone go continue you have to allow them to use the the camera so yes okay so this is me then it says join with video click on the join Basically, give it permission for everything. It needs permission to broadcast your voice and your video image to everyone else in the meeting. There's a couple of buttons that I want to point out to you. Uh, you take a look at the yellow one. That's your microphone. When you enter a meeting, uh, turn your microphone off. And then if you want to say something, turn your microphone back on. Right beside it, the lime green, is turn the video off. If we're going to be watching a movie or something else along those lines that are that's drawing a lot of bandwidth we want to turn both of them off and if we're in a discussion group where there's lots of people we might want to turn both of them off and then we'll focus on the orange ring on that orange ring is your participants when you click on that another window will open up and then you can put your hand up there's a button that says hand up on the bottom and then that'll allow me to say well wait a second we'll stop what we're doing someone has a question and we can go back to it and the last one, the, the light blue on the top, that's your exit button. To get out of this or leave a meeting, you can just click on that button and you're out. Now that you've mastered doing this on a phone, let's try doing this on a desktop or a laptop computer. Okay, I got mail. So I go down to my mailbox down here. I come up to here and it says, hey, look, I got a join Zoom meeting. Okay, so I'm on a laptop, not on my phone anymore. I go to join meeting. Click on the link here. Open Zoom. Join with video. Join with audio. That guy full screen. Now, this here is my kitchen in the basement. The reason why is because we had that feedback with the other laptop when I was trying to do it on the phone. So now I'm actually connected into the meeting. There's a couple things I want to show you here that are really, really important. When you join the meeting, come down and turn your microphone off. Okay. What will happen then is it saves on bandwidth. And if we're watching a video or a presentation, turn your video off as well. Okay. So you can turn that off. I will not be able to see you. I'll know that you're still there because you will have an image right here at the top of the screen. So I'll know you're still look, logged on and you will be able to hear me, but I won't be able to hear you and no one else will be able to hear you. Now, if we're in this mode, if we go down to participants, we can actually go over here and hit the raise hand. And that'll raise a hand that'll put a hand mark on my screen saying, Hey, I have a question. 
So I can turn around and stop what I'm doing and say, hey, and answer your question. It'll just keep the meetings a little bit more organized, okay? Nope. Hand. Minimize this down, close pop out. And when you're ready to leave the meeting, all you have to do is click on leave meeting when everything's done. And we finished. Okay. Pretty straightforward stuff. It depends if you're using the laptop or the phone. I hope this answers all of your questions. Hopefully this video helped you out. And if you enjoyed the video and it did help you, please like and subscribe. It's free and it'll help me out. All you have to do is click on the icon on my face and I'll do the rest. Have a great night.